Lizzie told me the Sphinx is riddle. It's a tough one. Yeah, I wonder what he meant by darkened souls. He means spirits? It's possible. Hey, by the way, uh, I just wanted to say I should have never voted you out. I'm sorry. Well, I, I should have never put you in that position, so we can both share the blame. <laughs> hey, what if the Sphinx isn't talking about spirits, but about monsters? Every one of them that came out of Malibu had the same agenda. They all follow the same path. Right. But I still don't get which two forge their own way. In blackness, a light emerges. The portal, the mystic falls. Illuminating the path for darkened souls to follow. The creatures that emerge from the portal. Two forge their own way. Hope and Clark. But a third sees a new path. You, you don't serve Malivore because you see a new path. You serve a new master. Mm. Well done. You solved my riddle. Malivore is terrible. But what's coming is even worse. Well, you're the Oracle, so tell us. What's coming next? There are two prisoners. One is the master of his cage. The other returns home without power. The sins of the father are visited upon the daughters here and not here. No hero rises but can be felled by the golden arrow. The wolf among you has many faces. When time fractures, the darkness overwhelms. But the greatest destroyer of all is love. Don't worry. It'll all be painfully clear soon enough. Now that the boy is away from Malavor's grasp, my work here is done. Until we meet again.